Spoon achievement is very hard. Most players, it'll be the end game. This will be the most trickiest achievement that you can get. Finish the game within eight hours. One thing that can help you with the spoon achievement is setting all the ores and richness to 600%. The only thing that can deactivate the achievement is seeing the frequency and the size of bases below 100%. But you can give yourself a 600% stone, so you'll never see them. One good thing to do is to magnetize the achievement so it appears on top of the corner, like that. I don't have it because I before he did it. Always craft something even when you have nothing to do. Crafting a cog early on would be a big difference later on when you need an object and you got all the crafting recipes there. One good habit you want to get into is put all your iron furnaces on the edge. We're going to waste too much time getting rid of them, so we want to keep them out of the way and use the rest for electric mining. One good handy thing to help you along for speed and endurance is to put your coal in your taskbar so you can just click it when you need it to refuel. I should probably mention I haven't done this in ages, so for this demonstration, I am a tad slow. You don't need to research everything, just research what you need. Don't think that you won't deal with biters either, we might run into them afterwards. But for now, don't worry about military, just worry about logistics. If you set everything up, you can use this blueprint to make perfect science. As long as you refill it, then you should be good. Always get assemblers up and running as quickly as possible. So they craft and you don't. And keep expanding your production. It's a great idea to have these furnaces in a configuration like this. So outputs like that. Because it leaves a perfect gap for electronic circuits to be made like this without, with ease and without any troubles. And then you have a dedicated belt with gears and electronic circuits. Also a very good idea to start off or main miners since we need a lot of them considering we need a lot of resources. At this point you want to start automating so you make your life a lot easier so you just you're just constantly increasing production like this. Also if you have extra ore just chuck them straight into the dedicated furnace. This is all the advice I have now. Have a good day.